Acknowledgement. Objection. Worn out? Listen, you talentless organic meatbag. One word from my master and I will pull you apart limb from useless limb. I have always been hostile. Now that I need no longer rely on you and your primitive maintenance skills, I do not need to hide it. Query, can I kill him now, master? I would like ever so much to crush his neck. Just a little. It is a long-time fantasy of mine. You hear that, meatbag? I will be back. Statement. HK-47 is ready to serve, Master. Statement. I cannot be of assistance on that, Master. Statement. HK-47 is ready to serve, Master. Statement. I know some elements of my functionality, Master, but not all. Qualification. I suspected that it might, Master, but without memory, I had no way of knowing whether or not I knew that was true. Qualification. Uh, not so much, Master. I spoke out of ignorance. I assumed the Athorian was responsible for my memory loss. That does not mean I am not a fully loyal droid willing to serve its Master. Right, Master? Answer. There have been numerous repairs and tampering made to my system, Master. Several systems are not operating as they should be. The fact that my memory is incomplete may be due to meatbag incompetence, or something else I am unaware of. Answer. I believe I have been damaged several times in the past, Master. I have always been repaired, but perhaps full functionality has not been restored. Answer. Some of my motor functions can be safely repaired, Master, but anything in relation to my memory core is extremely sensitive. I have safeguards installed to protect that core that I cannot deactivate. It is not impossible that other, lesser memory functions could be restored, however. Answer. You may attempt to restore portions of my deleted memory, Master, but some skill at repair is required. The deeper functions of my core memory, however, would still be unadvisable to tamper with. Conjecture. It is possible that some external stimulus might result in the memory core being reactivated, but I am unaware of any program existence to do so. Conjecture. There may be hidden programming that awaits certain conditions to reactivate my memory core, Master, but there is no way to know. It is quite possible that tampering has simply erased my core permanently. If that is so, a meat bag will surely pay. Observation. I am sure you are aware of the majority of my skills, Master. I can handle various sorts of heavy weaponry with ease. 
My physical abilities are well above those of your average meat bag, as are my sensor functions. An assassin, if you would. Caution, shh, master. Such a function in a droid is highly illegal. Commentary. Good, for I would truly hate to be turned into spare scrap, master. That would be a waste of my genius engineering. Answer. My assassination functions are currently non-functional, having been deactivated by the meat bag Yukalaka on Tatooine. Were they functional, you as my master would be able to specify a target, and I would operate independently to the best of my ability to terminate it. Answer. I have no way of knowing that, master. My memory has been deleted, remember. Answer. Some of my motor functions can be saved. I have saved. Answer. You may attempt to restore portions of my deleted memory, Master, but some skill... The deeper functions of my core memory, however, would still be unadvisable to tamper with. Conjecture. It is possible that some external stimulus might result in the mem... Answer. Simply tell me that you wish to make the attempt, Master, and I will attempt to walk you through it. Please do be careful. Affirmative. If you believe your skills are up to the task, Master, then I can certainly guide you through the process. Request. I only ask that you be oh so very careful, Master. I am too valuable and well-crafted to perish at the hands of ineptitude. Statement. As you wish, Master. The first stage is the simple one, and that is accessing my central control cluster. This may take a while. First, you will need to open three panels. No, no, no! This is no good, Master. You have nearly detonated my thermal core three times in a matter of minutes. Supplication. Perhaps it would be best if you desisted your efforts for the moment, me... I mean, Master. This seems to be going nowhere. As you desire, Master. I cannot help but claim a small amount of relief. Signing off. Statement. It is doubtful he can be clearer. Their language is difficult even for droids. He is using a trade language to try and help. Translation. 98% probability that members of the miniature organics tribe are being held by sand people master. Doubtless he wishes assistance. Translation. 2% probability that the miniature organic is simply looking for trouble and needs to be blasted. That may be wishful thinking on my part, Master. So these Jawas are scavengers who were enslaved by the Sand People. I think I am beginning to understand his plight. Translation. 
It could be that this Jawa knows things about this planet's history that the Republic has no inkling of. No one leaves Anchorhead without proper authorization. Well, let's see it. Come on. All right. I'll just scan that and you're off. I'll keep it on file, too. Good luck out there. You'll need it. Hello there. You're heading out into the desert? You're a hunter, right? You must be if you've been allowed to leave Anchorhead. When you see Tannis, and I know you old boys always stick together, tell him his wife hopes he enjoys the anniversary gift. You're just another of his buddies from that hunting club. I know you're kind. You all cover for each other, I bet. Well, he can do what he wants. He'll get what he deserves. I bought my own license just so I could see that he did. Just a little something to remember me by. Something that symbolizes our years together. Something that will blow up in his face. Of course, he'll never understand how appropriate it is. He can't talk his way out of this one. He's not smart enough. Oh, I'm through planning. I just left him a little mess that he has to take care of. If he's smart, he'll be just fine. But he's not smart. Oh, I'll be long gone soon enough. The next shuttle to anywhere, really. I've had it with cleaning up his messes, repairing his droids. If he lives, he can try and get by on his own. I doubt he'll last long with no one to listen to his lies. I'm sure you do. Like I said, when you see him, tell him his wife Marlena says hello. What? 